and yes, so to join us, uh, to join us and discuss uh, this Boko Haram badness, now Mr. Emmanuel Ubeche and uh, will be NUJ CMO inside the Abuja Council. Mr. Emmanuel, would they hail you this Kajad day? Good morning, all. Good morning. So what will be your reaction to this kill, kill matter with Boko Haram do this kind of badness inside Rio? But what do you get to chuck out to put on top of this matter? This matter will not be happening. Let's try to solve this very bad. Mm. It will not squeak my bed at all. Okay. And then you don't know, should see uh, our government never try for a proper in dealing with this uh, Boko Haram matter. Mm. Because the emergency people they help other people to survive all the violence, all the killing. But then they can't, they, they can't kill them now. Mm. So see, government never do well. Mm. You know, to imagine five persons at once. My That's Boko Haram don't kill so. The implication of the same fear go be the body mm. of other aid workers with be for Bono and every other place where they help to sustain people when this crisis don't deal with. Mm. So oh, wow. my own say government need to wake up proper proper mm. and deal with this Boko Haram and bad situation once and for all. Oh, wow. And Mr. Manuel, this badness uh, is too much and it's too strong for we here. And our hearts, they go out to the people them and when uh, they are relative, now you face this badness fate. And you've been here, the matter say, make um, them sack the service chief. So what do you think now where this kill kill don't they shell it? Anyhow, anyhow, what do you think about this matter? Make them still leave the service chief, I'll be making them replace them with people who get a bonger idea to take a hell of this badness. I know the other last part. I just want to know whether you support, say, make the service chief still there or make them bring new people we go help so that this matter will go, will go uh, fight them once and for all. Uh, uh, the issue is not even just saying that to uh, recruit more persons. Mm. If you recruit people and you don't give them the kind of um, equipment, uh, mm. weapons, guns, we don't need. We don't need to these bad, bad people. Mm. I'm not sure say we will get the kind of results we want. Mm. And um, if you don't pay them the allowances as at when due, you, you know, that for me, I think say that don't reach when uh, President Boy is supposed to resume the government to ensure say we get new ideas, we get new people when would they committed. Okay. You know, to the I'm war against uh, terrorism and insurgency. Not true. These people don't stay, so they don't just stay, mm -hmm. and they did not say not if it happened to them, whether they work or they don't work. Okay. So, so what do you go advise them? Um, and Mr. Manuel, what do you go advise last last? Because as a BC military men, they don't they by themselves, they resign so that they don't go lose their life. As the thing, they, it don't be like say it is worse, they go. So what do you go advise uh, the presido to, to do so that this Boko Haram badness, once and for all, it go end? Because now it's something where I know say they go fit do. Or what do you think? Well, my own is say we, we, we need to um, start to fall like I've been talking, we move seven streets, mm. bring proper funding okay. to people when they're on the front line fighting Boko Haram. Okay. If we don't do one of these ones, mm. not to happen, then the community must be ready to volunteer information to the government. Okay, not true. That information will go a long way, not true. Mm -hmm.